I've got one minute, 30 seconds to talk about philosopher Michel Foucault's concept of heterotopic spaces. Heterotopic spaces or heterotopias are real physical or mental spaces that act as other spaces alongside existing spaces. Foucault created six principles in order to explain this. Firstly, heterotopic spaces are spaces where norms of behaviour are suspended. Foucault divides this principle into two, heterotopias of crisis and heterotopias of deviation. Heterotopias of crisis are privileged, sacred or forbidden spaces reserved for individuals who are in relation to their society in crisis. By that he means adolescents, pregnant women or the elderly. Heterotopias of deviation are places where behaviour outside the norm can be exercised, for example psychiatric hospitals, prisons and care homes. The second principle of heterotopic space is that they have a precise and determined function and are reflective of the society in which they exist. Foucault offers the very concrete example of the Western Cemetery. Heterotopic spaces have the power to juxtapose several real places and emplacements simultaneously. A garden is a good example of that, where plants from around the world are juxtaposed together. Heterotopias are linked to slices of time and truly work when people are given a break from their traditional time. Time can either accumulate in the manner of libraries and museums or be transitory like a temporary fairground at the edge of a town. Heterotopic spaces always have a system of opening and closing and are not freely accessible. They require some sort of permission to enter, whether with a ticket, a gesture or some kind of ritual. Heterotopias have a function in relation to other spaces that exist. They are either spaces of illusion, Foucault offers us the example of the brothel, I have to take his word for that, or spaces of compensation, such as the 19th century English colonies in the New World. Finally, Foucault offers us the boat as the perfect example of a heterotopia. It is a floating piece of space, not fixed to any other place, except the infinity of the sea.